today we're tackling a true masterpiece. The London skyline, a city of history, grandeur, and more pigeons than people. Let's see if we can do it justice. Here are our building instructions. Instructions. Bit formal, innit? I say we build from pure instinct and undeniable talent. That means no instructions. Absolutely not. This is London, not an avant-garde experiment in chaos. Ugh, fine. But if we don't add something fun at the end, I'll riot. Okay, and since you two love measuring things, we'll be tracking height as we go. Okay, to get it out of your system, Yaya, why don't you go ahead and measure one of the bags? Yes! Scientific inquiry at its finest. Splendid! The bag measures 9 inches, fit for royal display. Alright, now that we've got that out the system, let's get to building. Hmm, looks like we're gonna need a few of these bricks. Who's got it? This is our first great test, the legendary hunt for the missing bricks. It's really not that deep. Eureka, this must be it. That is very much not it, but points for enthusiasm. Here are the correct pieces for us to get started. Brilliant, now let's get this base started. I really can never tell with all these similar bricks. The instructions always give us the exact brick. You just have to look. You just have to look. All right, fantastic progress. Now we have to build some tall structures, and London isn't exactly known for its towering heights, but let's make these landmarks shine. Okay, next up, we're gonna need some of these bricks here. Come on, are these bricks being Benedict Arnold's? What are you talking about, Yaya? <laughs> Someone doesn't know their history. Okay, here are the right bricks here. Now we attach this here, and boom! Tower Bridge is standing tall. Jolly good work, everybody! And surprisingly, you didn't put the pieces upside down this time. Okay, that was one time, and technically it was sideways. Okay, now before we move on, let's see how long the bridge is. Absolutely! Standing at a wonderful seven inches long. Practically a skyscraper on its side. That's awesome! Let's keep building and see how far we can take this. This is looking good. Let's keep going. Alright, on to the next. Hmm, need some of these bricks here. Come on, little bricks. Don't make me send a search party after you. Found them. Where's my knighthood? What time is it? <laughs> Big Ben! Alright, alright. One more structure to go. And just like that, we have a stunning London skyline. Would you look at that? It all came together. And remarkably, without major disaster. I expected at least one catastrophe. Hmm. Don't you think something's missing? Nothing is missing. Well, what if we add a tiny hidden hub? I mean, it is London after all. That's not part of the build. But mate, where am I supposed to watch my footy? <sighs> all right, you guys, now that the build is complete, let's see how tall each individual section is. Moment of truth. Have we constructed a modern marvel? The National Gallery is two inches. Nelson's column is two and a half inches. Big Ben is four and a half inches. The London Eye is six inches. And the Tower Bridge is a nice solid four inches. Wow, that's amazing! Well done, team. Absolutely brilliant. It's perfect and impressively tall. And historically accurate, thanks to my fine addition of a secret pub, which you can't know the location of because, well, it's a secret. 
Well, it wouldn't be a production with Yaya if there wasn't some special edition. <laughs> If you enjoyed this build with us and want to see more, please like and subscribe. Should we build Buckingham Palace next? Only, of course, if we can build corgis too. <laughs>